What's your favourite game at the fairground or amusement park? Is it bowling down skittles, throwing darts or shooting ducks? That's my favourite. You can make your own duck shooting game with a few odds and ends from around the home. Here's what you'll need. An empty matchbox. You'll also need an ice cream stick or wooden coffee stirrer. And you'll need two rubber bands. One should be fairly large, thick and strong, and the other should be thin and quite small. And you'll also need, for bullets, matchsticks. Now for this you can use either dead matches, matches that have been struck and gone out, or better still, use headless matches. And you can buy those quite easily at craft stores these days. They're very cheap and they're the best sort of bullet that you can use for this gun. Now here's what you do. You start by taking those two rubber bands and you join them together by looping the little one around the big one and pulling them tight. There we are. Then you take the large rubber band and you stretch that around an empty matchbox. There we are, like that. So that the little one is right down one end. Now on the opposite end, you insert the wooden stick, the ice cream stick or the coffee stirrer, so that it's about halfway down. There we are. Believe it or not, your gun is now completed and ready for loading. What we really need is to have a target ready to shoot at, a duck. And here's what you need to do to make the duck. Take a sheet of cardboard and simply draw a duck. Any size, any shape you like. I'm no great artist, but here's the way I draw a duck. Curve back, head, beak, and its fat tummy. Tail there, wing in position there, and an eye, and that's ready to cut out and color. I'll color this one yellow. Well, I'll start colouring it yellow and cut it out with a pair of scissors. You might guess I've already done that. Here's a completed duck, ready to be set up as a target. You'll notice that I've coloured it on both sides. That's not absolutely necessary, but it just makes it look a bit prettier for all observing. Now, to set it up, you can set it up on a cardboard box or, I find, a plastic ice cream container is ideal. And you need just one piece of sticky tape to do, th to do this. Tear off the sticky tape, put it across the base of the duck, and then near one edge, press it down onto the ice cream container, and you'll find that that'll stand up by itself if it's fairly thick cardboard. Now comes the loading of the gun. Come back to our gun here and insert a bullet. That is a headless matchstick. Push it down about a third of the way between the ice cream stick and the matchbox itself, and then stretch the small rubber band around behind that matchstick. When you're doing this, make sure that it isn't pointing at anybody. Hold it side on, as I am. Bring that rubber band around, down between the matchstick and the ice cream stick, and it's ready to go. Now all you need to do is aim and fire, but it's much better fun if you have a friend to compete with, and I have Michelle. There's your gun, already loaded. So aim it up, see if you can knock the duck over. Ooh, just missed. Now it's my turn. <laughs> and I missed. Second turn. Ready, loaded, aim. Wow, you got it. You win the prize, Michelle, a cardboard duck. This game is fun to make and play on a rainy day. Try it.